suppose that we were going to take a post machine and we're going to add a character at the beginning of this string. So let's suppose we start with the string BBBA and we want to add the letter A at the beginning of that string. Now, the textbook on page 468 demo shows how this can be done, but let's just walk through it here. Basically, we will we'll start, it's always the first part of the post machine, and we're going to add some kind of a character to demonstrate, to, to, to indicate, sorry, where the end of the string is. And so we're just going to call it a dollar sign. We're going to add a dollar sign. Then after we add that dollar sign, we're going to add the character that we want to append at the beginning. So in this case, it's this A here. Now once we've added that A, all we got to do is loop through the rest of the string until we get to the dollar sign, and bada boom, we've got, we've got our appended string. So what we do is we read the next character. And if it's uh, an A, that's just, if it's an A, we add an A and go back to the next read. If it's a B, we add a B and again just go back to that read again. And if it's a dollar sign, we're done. And we will have completed this little operation here. So let's let's walk through this. Let's kind of go through this step by step so you can see what's going on. We're going to start off with B B B A. We're going to start off with B B B A. And we want to append an A at the beginning of the string. So we start, we add a dollar sign. So now we have B, 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 A, dollar sign. We're going to add an A. So now we have B, 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 A, dollar sign, A. That's the A we want to have at the beginning of our string. Then we read the first character. It's a B. So we add a B which basically we added at the end over here. And now this one's gone. The next character we add is a B. So we add a B and that one's gone. Same thing, B, and B again, that one's gone. Then the next one's A, that one's gone. And then we get to the dollar sign and we're done. The result, A, B, 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 A, A, B, 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 A. We don't have the dollar sign. Anymore. So that's how this little, uh, operation works and it's called add front I think in the book. The add front or add to front. They call it uh, they call it add front A. But if any of you didn't see how that works, this little video kind of shows you how that add front A works.